How's it going, everybody? Another day in the truck. Another day on the road. Another day when it's raining. It's uh, We're currently here in New Boston, Michigan, which is a suburb of Detroit. And uh, it was pouring rain last night. Got soaked. Just got my paperwork, so looking through it real quick um, it's pouring rain last night so I got soaked and then I uh, went to Streetsboro Ohio delivered that load and then made it back here shut down for the night woke up grabbed my paperwork now I'm just looking for my trailer and uh, we'll get hooked up and then head out to Milwaukee um, it's about a 330 mile drive if I remember right Um, sorry, a lot of things going on. I always gotta pay attention to work first. Um, and then I don't know what we're doing after that yet. I don't have anything planned or any loads on me yet that have, uh, they put a pre-plan on me that picked up uh, at Costco in Illinois, heading back to Minnesota, but that was for tomorrow. And it would kind of suck to just sit around only do 330 miles for the day and then sit around until tomorrow to pick up that load to then deliver on Thursday or Friday. Um, looking for 180235. But uh, yeah, they ended up taking that off. So now they're uh, looking for another one. I really wish this rain would stop. There's my trailer. Today's the, that like sprinkly crap that sucks. That's really hard. Like your wipers, you don't know which uh, which level to put your wipers on because of it. Uh, the mist just can't make its mind up. So we hook up to we always hook up to it and then do a tug test to make sure that the uh, the fifth wheel grabbed onto the kingpin. And uh, then you're nice and safe and connected. But anyways, um, I'm gonna give a shout out to a couple of really great fa fans actually that have been uh, commenting and um, uh, Jake, uh, he's been a subscriber of mine since I just started the series and he's been commenting on a lot of things, uh, liking the video. And also my boy Matt Tice, uh, he just subscribed and smash that like button smash that little bell <laughs> we're having a joke about that because our kids watch uh, YouTube videos and they always say you know there's these big you know they get all crazy and like grabbing the phone they're like oh make sure you smash that like button whoa join the like squad the bell squad yeah <laughs> I won't do that but when I have my kids this weekend, I can't guarantee that they won't. They're, they're gonna wanna get on, the, on and do some videos and stuff. But uh, uh, but yeah, I mean, if you uh, if you guys do a comment on any one of my videos, I'll, feel, I'll do a shout out, hell yeah. I wanna see if the analytics actually do get affected by comments and everything like that, it'd be kinda cool. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna hook up to this trailer real quick. And uh, thank you to everybody else that has subscribed so far. Um, it's, it's a slow roll, slowly building up a fan base and a crowd. And then uh, hopefully we'll be getting up to that level that we can start being uh, a lot more successful and uh, things will start working out pretty well for, um, for the videos. So then I can maybe look at different uh, lines of work essentially. You no, know, not just doing, um, not just doing trucking but you know maybe making more videos more entertaining videos i got a drone i'm gonna uh, be flying the drone around once i clean the basement out and i find the battery charger because uh when i moved i put the battery charger downstairs and i don't know where it went and uh yeah so but again thank you to everybody who subscribed so far uh, please try to uh comment if you can uh make sure you, you can even just hit that like button that like button's gonna do a lot with the uh analytics and making um making it uh youtube see it and be like hey you know it's becoming more of a popular channel and then they'll start uh recommending this video or this channel to um 
to people that don't know me and that aren't Facebook friends with me and, uh, you know, strangers essentially. And that's how you start, you're really gaining a fan base. But, you know, obviously you got to start with what you know, which is your friends and family and, your, you know, people on Facebook and stuff like that. And the more you, you know, the more you work you put into it, the more you'll get out of it. Unfortunately, with this line of work, I can only dedicate so much time as it is. And, uh, I want to try to put more effort and more time into this, into making these videos and stuff. Um, it just needs to, it'll be slow <laughs> because I'm just trying to gain a fan base and everything like that. And then, uh, kind of go from there. Leave me a comment too. If you have any ideas of, uh, things you want to see. Um, like I said, I am going to make a video eventually of shifting, um, how I do all my shifting, how, you know, the, the, all the switches that are on there. Um, and the same thing too, once I actually get my truck cleaned up, it's not actually that dirty in here, but it's too dirty for me as an OCD to show the Facebook world or the YouTube world. But anyways, I'm going to hook up to this trailer and, uh, we'll get the show on the road. See ya. Oh, I forgot too. I got to give a shout out to my, my boy, John. I grew up with the kid. He's like my brother. He's the one that, uh, kept me motivated to keep making these videos. Um, uh, me and him grew up right down the road from each other and we yeah he's he's, he's pretty much like my brother and uh, I just want to thank you John for keeping me motivated and uh, and doing this but uh, just about to check out here so get down the road especially when I can find it for under three bucks a gallon. But in this part of Michigan, it's really hard to find cheap fuel. Um, and uh, so I just figured I'd get enough to get me to Milwaukee and then possibly to a shipper after that to pick up my next load. Um, but yeah, so I'll give you an update. I'll try to get some more videos on the road. Um, I'll give you an update when I get, uh, uh, find out what's going on next when it comes to my next load. So. Yeah, let's keep this party going, huh? All right, so I just got my next few loads. Um, I'll be delivering this one in Milwaukee, and then after that, I will be going to uh, Indiana to pick up a load to bring that down to Columbus. And uh, it's about 100, 100 some odd empty miles and then uh, 200 and something loaded. And then after that, um, I'll probably be running out of hours once I get down to uh, to Columbus or just before. Um, and then I will be heading to, after that I'll have a load um, I'm picking up in, uh, if I remember right, Illinois. Oh no, sorry in Michigan, uh, Westland, Michigan. I'll be picking up a load there, and uh, then I'll be bringing that to T-Call in Gary, Indiana. Um, that'll get me in the uh, vicinity, vicinity, wow. Oh, that's a big bump. The section of road is pretty bad, Michigan here. Uh, then I'll be, that'll get me in the Chicago area, so then I'll be able to uh, possibly grab a Costco load. Um, to bring me back home for a Friday delivery and uh, get me home to pick up the kids and uh, spend the weekend with them. And I know I'm probably going to be doing a bunch of videos. I don't know how much editing I'll be able to get done, but I know I'll be taking a bunch of videos um, with the kids because 
because they they love doing YouTube videos and stuff like that. So um, they also my we have like a family account um, that we uh, that the kids mostly do. They mostly uh, make videos on there. It's called the Duke Family Does. Um, that's the channel name. Uh, I got um, I think we got three or four, four or five videos on there right now. It's just uh, a bunch of them of the kids, you know, having fun doing whatever they do, making videos of making slime and all that stuff. So go ahead and go over and check that out as well if you want. Um, give that a subscribe. But, uh, but yeah, so we're about uh, 200 miles from uh, Milwaukee. I uh, just got to go down around Lake, or, uh, Lake Michigan and then head back up. And uh, yeah, should be a pretty smooth ride. It's a little, it's just misty out right now. Um, having to you play with the wipers here and there. But uh, yeah, we'll just keep on trucking and uh, hopefully this week keeps going smooth like it is. It's definitely gotten a lot better than last week. That's <laughs> So we got the here at the uh, Milwaukee Chrysler. Uh, just made my delivery, waiting to hear back. They don't have any empties here, so I'm just waiting to hear back from the um, from the ECT, which is the person that works at night in the office. Um, if I can bobtail to the next shipper, if not, I have to go and try to find an empty at. Uh, along the way they'll dispatch me on a um letting me know what uh what customer i can go pick up an empty at um so just kind of hanging out and waiting and uh i'm in milwaukee so the roads are really crappy and i'll tell you i'm not going to try to get any videos <laughs> with how crappy their roads are they have that concrete that after a while it starts to sink so and it sits like this right so then when you're going across it, you're going like that a whole bunch in your truck. And it's just, it's horrible. And it's the, I hate bobtailing through this city because their roads are crappy. I understand why they use concrete because it's supposed to last longer, but it just sinks <laughs> after so long. Uh, it's, yeah, it's bad. But anyway, it's kind of cool here. They got a bunch of, uh, um, frames to some trucks some dodge trucks out here here check it out whole bunch of frames out here the weird thing is i don't know why they have all those frames here anyways because this isn't even a manufacturing plant this is a parts distribution center i don't know i know that when i picked up loads coming from here it's just a bunch of random parts. It's I haven't picked up a, a trailer full of frames or anything like that. So I don't know, but uh, I'm gonna send them another message in and find out what's going on with this next load situation because I'm bored and I'm sick of sitting. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. I'll see you later.
out for the night. I am in Spiceland, Spiceland, <laughs> Indiana. Um, got about uh, 130 miles to go to finish up this load for tomorrow. Uh, it's the, about about a 30,000 pound load. Um, and then uh, we have to go pick up that load in um, Michigan. And then bring that to Gary, which again will get me in the Chicago area, which then hopefully they'll be able to find me a load back home to Minnesota. Um, this is just going to be a quick outro. Uh, I got a lot of editing I got to do. I got to catch up on two days worth of uh, videos to try to get out to you guys as soon as possible. Um, if you can, please uh, spread the word. Try to get uh, try to get this in, uh, get some more popularity out of this, so I can get some more subscribers and uh, we can keep uh, making these videos or at least I can know that they're um, you know worthwhile <laughs> um, I'm trying to I'm doing some research on finding some uh, different mounts for the uh, cameras make them a little bit smoother um, for you know like being dash mounted and stuff like that so they're a lot uh, smoother um, I don't know if the stabilization of the of the uh, the internal stabilization needs to be turned off or something like that or not. Right now I'm just trying this, uh, I, got, I, got, I got a gimbal so I can move that around and it's nice and smooth and be kind of cool. I, can, I know I have an extension at home to get this a little bit further out, but yeah, see, just doing that. Um, but anyways, uh, yeah, try to spread the word if you can. It'd be kind of cool to see how far this gets out. Um, and then... Uh, I'll do what I can to try to, um, it's not going to be just the trucking stuff. Um, I'm going to try to do some other things, especially like once I get home on the weekends and everything like that, especially with the kids uh, and then the summer's coming up. So I'll be able to do a lot more, um, things outside and, uh, kind of get a little bit more, um, a little more fun, stuff like that. Uh, once I get my drone going, I'll be getting some drone footage going and, uh, yeah, I got a lot of plans, a lot of things in the future that I want to try to do with this, but um, yeah, I don't know. I'm tired, and I know every night I've been staying up for at least another two hours to uh, do photo or video editing. Um, but uh, yeah, for, uh, so make sure you um, make sure you like, and you know, it doesn't take much. Just hit that like button. Um, that way you can get a little bit more you know the analytics like I was talking about earlier it's, it's Facebook's or I mean YouTube's um, their way of seeing if a, uh, a channel is popular and stuff um, hit that like button and then uh, if you're not a subscriber please subscribe um, and then that way you'll you, uh, wow that way you can get notifications um, when I put the next video up uh, that little bell button next to the subscribe you can hit that and then you'll get a notification um, on the actual on YouTube's app or on your computer whatever you watch this on and then you can uh, that way you know right when I put up a new video um, hopefully I'll be getting caught up on the video so then I can make it where the day that you get the video is the previous day so I'm not talking from the future or the past however you want to call it because uh, currently it is uh, my Wednesday which is I guess it's like 3 o'clock in the morning Eastern right now where I'm at, which is 2 o'clock Central, which is where the time, my home time is at. And uh, and it is currently, technically it's Thursday, um, but it's my Wednesday work day. I know it's all confusing, but it'll you'll figure it out. It'll uh, be kind of, yeah, the lighting is really goofy in here. It makes me look old like that. <laughs> But anyways, hope you guys have a good night, a good day, a good morning, wherever you're at. And we'll see you tomorrow. Keep on trucking. Later.